Joyce Mitchell, tearful in court and taking responsibility. Because the evidence was so overwhelming, um, Ms. Mitchell has acknowledged her um, guilt. The 51-year-old former prison employee admitting she helped inmates Richard Matt and David Sweat escape from New York's Clinton Correctional Facility. Are you pleading guilty because you are in fact guilty? Newly released documents reveal the details of what Joyce Mitchell knew and when. I've known about them cutting the hole in the wall for about three or four weeks, Mitchell tells investigators in the days following the escape. During the police interviews, Mitchell revealing she had sent Sweat sexual letters and naked photos, but adding that she only had sexual contact with Matt. We were alone and inmate Matt grabbed me and kissed me. It startled me. He kissed me with an open mouth kiss. I didn't say anything because I was scared for my husband who also works in the facility. Mitchell also says there was oral sex with Matt and other sexual encounters with the inmate who plotted to kill her husband, referred to as the glitch. She explains, after I picked them up, the plan was to drive to my home and inmate Matt was going to kill the glitch. After, we were going to drive somewhere. I can't remember where we were going to go, but I know I was told it was around six, seven hours away. The plan to lay low in the woods together for a week, says Mitchell. Then Matt would split off, leaving her and Sweat together. But Mitchell got cold feet and couldn't go through with it, telling investigators she loved her husband Lyle too much. And Lyle Mitchell was actually inside the courtroom when Joyce Mitchell accepted the plea deal. His attorney says he's still hopeful he can have a life with her. Meanwhile, Joyce Mitchell told police that Richard Matt gave her pills to give to her husband, which would knock him out. She says she never gave him the pills. She doesn't know what they were, and she ultimately flushed them.